Badminton is a complex game. That's why I love the sport. That can also lead to challenges in finding the right strategies to beat your opponent. Does this sound familiar to you? If it does, I'm gonna take you through two key strategies that you can use in your badminton singles. Okay then, let's dive into it. Number one, vary your pace. And what do I mean by that? As a player, there's nothing more uncomfortable than playing against a player that are super good at varying the pace, switching from fast to slow, slow to fast, always making me hesitate on what's coming. If you only play at a high speed or at a slow speed, your opponent will quickly recognize the patterns and get used to that. And that's why varying the pace is so efficient. As you can see in this rally, we're playing at a steady pace and suddenly Mass decides to change the pace for the three following shots. This is making me super uncomfortable and you can see it clearly catches me off guard and gives Mass the advantage in the rally. So I'd really recommend you to practice changing the pace in your rallies. I promise you this will help you in your singles and it's a fantastic strategy. Number two, finding your opponent's best shots and let them use it early in the game. So let me explain. Everyone got their favorite shots and their habits. As you can see, early in the match, Mass played some great forehand deceptions. So now I know this is one of Mass's favorite shots and it's a habit every time it gets to his forehand, he wants to play that deception. This I can use to my advantage for the rest of the match. Because I know this is one of his favorite shots, I want to play some extra shots to his forehand and anticipate that he wants to do this deception. Especially when the set gets closer, because if I play it to Mass's forehand and he wants to do it, I can be ready and also I actually make him hesitate a bit on what he's supposed to do because he played it so much that maybe he needs to do a, a new shot because every time a game gets close that's where players tend to get back to their habits so I know Mess he wants to do his deception that's why I want you to figure out what your favorite shots of your opponent are early in the game because you are able to use it later in the game this was the two key strategies that I had for you. I really hope that you learned something. And also, if you have a topic that you want us to cover, leave it in the comment section. And lastly, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get new badminton tips. See you in our next video.